Hi there, and today I'm going to show you how to use one of my favorite recorders, and that's ScreenPal. It used to be called Screencast-O-Matic when I started it many, many years ago. So you need to download it to your computer. I'm going to do that. It's really, really amazing. I'm not going to tell you about its amazing features. All I want to do is show you how to record. So we're going to go into Record, click on it wait for the launching recorder to come up. And here it is. Then we're going to record just the screen. Make sure that the audio is working and if we want another voice, we might want to be able to do that. Sure. Okay, so make sure you do that. I'm gonna do it later since I don't need it now. Next, I'm going to hit record. I've got my screen, I've got my narration voice. You can go ahead and record. To have your screen open wherever it has the screen that I want. Okay, this is the screen and I want to demonstrate. So you have to be there. If you want somewhere else, you go somewhere else. That's fine. It'll go wherever you go. So you can go anywhere. Go to different pages. It'll go with you. Uh, different windows. It'll go with you. So it's actually amazing. Uh, not all of them work like this and uh, GreenPal is really, really strong very effective and user-friendly. Next, I am going to show you the left of this course page, the right, and let you know that everything within the blue is actually the course. So everything in here is the course. The top step is the top of the, and then you can scroll down, of course, till you get to the very end. At the end, okay, there we go. You will see the last item. Okay, so uh, we are going to end this by clicking on the stop or the two bars. And then we're going to go into the edit. We'll hover your mouse over what's on the right there in your panel and go into edit video and add captions. Don't want to do any more. And then notice what we get here. Get this and we want to publish it. All right, so instead of the publish, it'll say save project as a file. You'll save it as a file and then you'll upload it to YouTube or Google Drive as a file and then make sure that you share it as public so everyone can view it. In this case, I'm going to go to the share, click on it, and then I'm going to publish it because I just want to share the link. I'll need to give it a title or it's going to be recording number 44, but I'm gonna leave it like that, recording number 44. I think that's fine in this case. All right, so let's publish it and, and that's it. I can also, okay, here it comes. I can notice recording number 44. I can open the upload, the link, and continue in the background. There are lots of features on ScreenPal, as I said, a lot of annotations and things that you can add to it. But I'm not going to show you that right now. I'm simply going to continue in the background. And there is the background and let you check it out for yourself. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you have any questions because I love questions. Bye for now.